Okay, I'm trying to make a little video about um, bypassing Windows 11, trying to force you to use a Microsoft account. This is in a virtual machine on Proxmox, which if you don't know what that is, doesn't matter. Basically, if you have a desktop computer that you bought with Windows 11 Home, if it's if you have the Pro edition of Windows, just don't connect it. Just It'll, even if you're connected to the internet, there's an option and I have another video about installing Windows 11 there to see how to do it, where you can create a local account. But in Windows Home Edition, which is what most computers that people buy at the local store or Best Buy or something like that has, they're trying to force you to. So what I've done in this virtual machine is there is no network connection right now. It's disabled. The network connection is disabled. If you had a desktop computer, just don't plug the wire in. If you have Wi-Fi, do not put in your password. And it may, this may be different in different machines. But when you get to this screen where it's trying to force you to use a network connection, hold down your shift in F10. And it's going to pull up a command prompt and type in T-A-S-K-M-G-R. That stands for Task Manager. And you're going to get the Windows Task Manager pop up. And this network connection flow. Let's kill that in that task and when we do we should get the option to put a local account in so now I can I have to click so the keyboards active I should be able to start entering a local account again and it's going to ask for stupid question answers I'm just making up stuff here get by for this demo now I don't have a laptop that has Wi-Fi on it to test it or do a demo on it right now I'm brand new one that's never had Windows 11 but do not connect to the internet and use that hack let me know if, he, if you had any trouble. I'm not going to finish the rest of the setup because it's not relevant to the bypass. This is where the bypass was. Don't connect to the internet until you're on the desktop. Hope this helps somebody.